We'll guide you through how to connect your laptop to your TV. If you find this guide useful, then please consider subscribing and liking the video. And you can follow this guide on either a Windows computer or a Mac. So first of all, we need to go and see what outputs our laptop has and what inputs our TV has to then go and find what cable we can go and use. So on my laptop here, I've got an HDMI output, as you can see just here. However, if your laptop or TV don't have HDMI outputs or inputs, then you may need to go and use a different type of cable, but you can also go and use adapters. For example, if your TV does have HDMI, but your laptop doesn't, then you can always get like a USB to HDMI adapter or something like that. And we'll go and put some links in the description, which will be affiliate links, which support the channel at no extra cost, some adapters you can check out on Amazon. But for me, I can just use an HDMI cable. So this end can go on my laptop and this end can go on my TV. I've now plugged the HDMI into my laptop here and then I've gone and plugged the other end into my TV. So now what you need to do is go and turn your TV on. Once your TV is turned on, you'll need to go on to remote and go and click on the sources button just here. It may be slightly different for you. And then you'll need to go and go through your different sources until you find the one your laptop is connected to. So in this case, I need to go to HDMI 2, just like that. And then my laptop screen should then appear on my TV, just like that. To get your display settings in Windows, all you need to do is press on the Windows key and P at the same time. And this project menu will open up and you can then go and choose if you want to go and duplicate your screen, extend it, or go and use one of the screens at a time. So it's going to be up to you on how you want to do it. On your Mac, open up your system settings and then scroll down on the left hand side and click on displays. Then you can go and see your TV here. You want to go down to use as, and there you can go and select how you use your TV and your Mac together, whether you go and mirror your screen or you go and extend the displays.